SN1 mechanism is actually a lot different from the SN2, even though from start to finish it's still the same. You're doing a substitution, removing one group, and adding a different. So the very first step, rather than nucleophiles and electrophiles, is the leaving group coming off. So bromine comes off, keeps the electrons, so you get Br minus. Carbon lost them, so you get a plus charge. And then you have an intermediate that can react with the nucleophile. So we've made a new bond between oxygen and this carbon. But it's kept the plus charge, so oxygen's got a new bond, but these two char still keep a plus charge, and you have your negative charge counter on it. At this point, there's a couple of ways you can draw it. Uh, an easy way, which might not be perfectly correct in terms of what's actually happening, is a bromide acting as a base. That removes the extra hydrogen and gives you your alcohol and HBR as a product.